So we see color wheels most often with paint, but we can also use materials like oil pastels, really anything that you can blend together. So I do want you to only use the primary colors for this exercise. So we have red, yellow, and blue. And on this color wheel, I have 12 shape, um, shapes. I like them touching, they could be separate. Um, touching is nice so you can see that transition. And so my primary colors are every kind of third wheel. So to mix my oil pastels, I need to lay down my darker color first. Now I'm gonna make a secondary and tertiary color. So I'm starting with my um, yellow and red. And so in the middle, right, I'm working on now is my orange. And then I already made my yellow orange and now I'm making my orange red. So you can see when I laid down that color, I um, put it a little darker as it was closer to that original piece, right? So the blue is darker, closer to the actual blue. And see here, I'm just mixing together. So you're gonna do this to create a full color wheel of the, um, of the main primary, secondary, and tertiary colors. And then I want la you to label them with a P for primary, S for secondary, and a T for tertiary. And then I want to create tints and shades and practice brown. So a tint is created with white, but first I'm gonna just choose a color. Of course you can make a tint and a shade for every color, but just practice it with one. So I've laid down my, bl my blue in this case and added white. And then for a shade, I need to add black. And then a brown is ultimately just a mixture of all primary colors because it's basically just really muddy. And sometimes you might add a little bit of black in there too. With oil pastels, I, it's a little bit harder to get it really blended together, but you can start to see where a brown would come through here. So again, this is just practicing um, achieving color more for your reference than anything else. So when you're all done, you should annotate, meaning adding um, definitions, what is a secondary, what is a tertiary, how do I get a tint, how do I get a shade, so that you have reference for later.